All right, what's going on, guys? Welcome back to another Dokkan Battle video. So we've got some major, major leaks from Team Dokkan this morning related to the upcoming LR for part two of the worldwide celebration. And uh, before we go any further, before I say anything else, uh, I just want to be extra clear that none of this is official. It's not 100% confirmed until we see, you know, something in the in-game news or we get a preview on the official Twitter page. But, but as you guys may know, Team Dokener's track record with these things, with these leaks, is very, very good. So it's basically confirmed at this point. Anyways, about 30 minutes ago, he tweeted out this panel from the manga, which has Vegeta saying, uh, let's go Kekarot or go on Kekarot. It's you who is number one or you are number one, right? And uh, you guys might recognize this scene as that like, fight between Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Kid Buu where Vegeta is on the sidelines giving this like super emotional monologue uh, all the flashbacks of like when they first met and all that stuff and him finally recognizing just how strong Goku is and finally giving Goku his respect right it's definitely one of my favorite scenes in the anime for sure and uh, when I first saw this I was like okay there we go LR Super Saiyan 3 Goku confirmed for the part 2 legendary summon banner right i mean i think a lot of people saw this coming it was definitely one of the most popular choices but uh, this you know kind of cemented it but then but then about 10 minutes after this tweet came out he also tweeted another panel which has super saiyan 2 vegeta saying let's go i'm coming or i'm attacking or whatever i mean my french is pretty rough not gonna lie but you guys get the point right super saiyan 2 vegeta so i'm like oh okay so it's not just going to be Super Saiyan 3 Goku, it's going to be Super Saiyan 3 Goku most likely exchanging into Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta, and then there's got to be an active skill too, right? There's got to be the Spirit Bomb active skill. So I'm assuming it's going to be, you start off as Super Saiyan 3 Goku, and then you exchange into Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta when you fall below like a certain amount of HP or after a certain amount of turns, really depends on how they want to build it. Hopefully it's not too bad of a condition. And then through an active skill, you got to launch, launch the Spirit Bomb that took out Kid Buu, and uh, that's going to be the card. So I'm going to say, yeah, a Super Saiyan 3 uh, Goku and a Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta exchange card with a Spirit Bomb active skill. That sounds about right. I, I think that sounds hype enough to be the Part 2 LR. And for people that wanted a Kid Buu, um, I don't know if it's going to happen, guys. I mean, look. This doesn't rule out the the possibility that we get a second new LR, right? Even though last year we only got one new LR for the top legendary summon banner, it was the LR Androids and then uh, LR Gohan with the revamped active skill, or not active skill, the revamped uh, super attack animation, right? But there's always a chance that instead of doing one you know, new LR and one old LR with a revamp, they could just straight up give us two new LRs, just like the five-year anniversary, right? With the Broly and the Rosé. Maybe this time they'll give us the uh, Goku and Vegeta exchange card as well as a new Kid Buu, right? I mean, it's possible. It's possible. So possibly also a Kid Buu. Who knows? Um, maybe they'll just stick to the one LR for the Legendary Summon banner. But Dokkan has, you know, changed things up in the past. They don't always follow tradition. They don't always follow patterns, right? So... For those of you that wanted a Kid Buu LR, um, I think there is still some hope. I just refreshed the page real quick because I want to see if there's anything I missed, but uh, it doesn't seem like there's going to be any more updates for now. So at this point in time, we have this, and we have this. And this is enough to tell us that we're getting Super Saiyan 3 Goku and a Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta. But uh, maybe in a couple hours, maybe tomorrow, we'll get another panel with a Kid Buu or something like that. We'll have to see. But uh, this is the update, guys. All right, let me know in the comments down below how you feel about this. I know a lot of people were hoping for Kid Buu or maybe hoping for um, a Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks that exchanges into Ultimate Gohan. And that was a popular theory because a lot of people were talking about it, right? And because those guys were in the title screen, it felt like they were maybe teasing that there was going to be a summonable card with those characters. But I think this definitely makes a lot more sense right having uh, Super Saiyan 3 Goku and Super Saiyan 2 Vegeta and they just gotta incorporate that spirit bomb in there somewhere right like it's gotta it's gotta be in there so 
This card makes a lot of sense to me. I'm definitely hyped for it. I can't wait to see these animations, especially that Spirit Bomb. If it ends up being a thing, it has to be a thing. No, it has to be a thing. It's, it's got to be in there. So I'm excited to see that. And uh, maybe, just maybe, we'll also get a Kid Boo leaked uh, sometime within the next 24 to 48 hours. Of course, if that happens, I will be, I will be back with another video. You guys can, can rest assured about that. So, uh, yeah, we'll see what happens, guys. But this is all we got right now. This is all the news. Thank you so much for watching. Hope you guys are hyped for part two. As I've said many, many times, uh, I do expect it to be better than part one was because the bar really isn't very high. Let's be honest. The bar isn't very high. So it, even if part two is just an average major celebration, like part, right? Then it's going to be much better than part one was because part one was way below average. So, uh... Hopefully the LR is great, but hopefully more like more so than that, it gave us more events and just more things to do with these new units. Okay, so anyways, that is the video. Once again, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you guys. I will see you in the next video. As always, if you liked this video, then make sure to like the damn video. And if it's your first time watching me, first time to the channel, and you like what you see, then definitely hit that big red subscribe button. To join the Tiger Squad now, and while you're at it, hit that notification bell too, so that YouTube knows you want to stay up to date with all my latest content. And that's it. I'm out of here. Until next time, hope you guys have a fantastic, fantastic day. I'm Tiger with Tiger Uppercut Media, signing out.